wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. The lineup we have suggests it's going to be a 4 5 1 formation, Jim. Well, this setup, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protective layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter attacks if you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot. It can have a, a devastating effect, actually, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. we go then Jim which player is best equipped for this game it has to be the brains of the operation Tony Kroos he's another one of the elite passers in world football and his consistency remains high at, at both club and international level and one of the first picks in the team he would be the obvious choice wouldn't he he certainly has all the right qualities And it's Azza. And he's going long. Knocks it away. Now it's Azza. Azza looking to get on the end of this. And he heaves it forward. Deflected behind for a corner kick. However they tried to stand in his way, he just was not to be denied. Lucas Vasquez demonstrated great strength there. I mean, he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away. And I think it's just top, top play. Real Madrid ahead, one goal to the good. Forward it goes, Mendes tries lifting it over, tries to dink it, and Aspas! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Real Madrid have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Dennis Suarez. Jago Aspas. Gorgeous control there. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that is a terrific save. Out wide to the right. A real chance to break. Hazard is going to run down the left wing. Marcel. Sergio Ramos. Rafael Varane. 
And it's Benzema. And helps available out wide. And it's hoisted clear. Denis Suarez. Out to the left it goes. Sisto. Yago Aspas. He's in, sh shapes the shoots. Lucas Vasquez goes looking, and now they can launch a counter. Mendes plays it forward. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Been one straight back. Sisto. Dennis Suarez. Now it's Aspas. Aimed low and direct. Hazard tries to get it forward quickly. Benzema. Benzema! Back of the net! Two up and threatening to pull clear. The understanding between those two plays a big part in that, and releasing the run on side proved the key ingredient. Real Madrid get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Isco not easily shrugged off the ball. Aimed low and direct. And it's Aspas. Mendes. Celta Vigo are trailing here with the first half almost done. Denis Suarez pushes it out wide. And he's whipped it in low. Father Hell can hoist it clear. Gets it back. Isco. Modric goes looking. Chip through. It's Benzema! I can't speak highly enough of the keeper after that save. Can't stop thinking about it. Denis Suarez. And there's the end of the first half. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first-half success with a, another show of strength? So, off we go once more. Well, this half might require them to produce a plan A, B and C. Leveling the score is easier said than done. But that will be the target. Get back on terms and then use that momentum to go again. Now it's Aspas. There is Suarez. Back into the middle. Really 
good feet. And he's there to hoof it away. Out for a throw. Mendes. It's Dennis Suarez. Dennis Suarez plays it out to the flank. Loose ball. Who's going to get that? Real Madrid get it back again. It's gone for a throw in. Forward it goes. Plays it out to the wing. Harvey Hal positions himself well and cuts it out. Well, we don't need to guess that they expect plenty of, of ball into the box. <laughs> it's quite a crowd scene in the middle now. Well, it's a situation that requires resilience now and, and plenty of fighting spirit. It has to be matched. And the weighted pass, Lucas Vasquez looking to run onto it. Cruz. Dinks one in. Harvey Hal plays it into the box. Danger averted for now. Harvey Hal looking for a decent ball in. Isco's crop. Gets up to head it! Oh, just needed a better contact. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. of accuracy tried to play it through yeah the idea was right the delivery wasn't they can revisit that further on Marcelo plays it forward lovely bit of skill there boots it to safety Denis Suarez Yago Aspas forward it goes Lovely feet. We sit high. Sister looking to get on the end of this. And there's going to be a change now with the ball out of play. <laughs> Lucas Vasquez. <laughs> scoring skills have already been evident. Now it's Benzema. Tony Kroos. And it's Lucas Vasquez. Rafael Varan. Sergio Ramos. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. Rafael Varane, Marcelo, Hazard, that is terrific skill. Well, Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Tries to get it forward quickly. Celta Vigo can admit to being second best so far. They've not looked together enough and concentration levels are well down on the standard we expect. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Gets into some space, into the box. Sergio Ramos drops it away. 
It's anyone's ball. Could move up a gear here. Gets wrestled off the ball. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Over to the left. System. It's flagged offside. Yeah, a defence that likes to play a, a high line, and they're not disappointing. Keeper goes long, and it's Benzema. Tony Kroos. Marcelo. Aimed long and direct. A oh, really good feat from him. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. No joy for the players, nor indeed for the loyal fans. It has ended in defeat, a thoroughly disappointing outcome. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Inevitable in terms of the result, but that doesn't tell an accurate tale. This was much closer than it should have been. They really dug deep. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.